they are hesitant to proclaim or defend the truth. Now, granted, we do have to take into consideration how the person will respond and be gentle with regard to their emotional instability, perhaps. But we have to consider also, Tom, what you just beautifully mentioned, that if we do not try our best to gently and lovingly help them reorder their mind to conform to reality, we're actually doing them harm. Mm-hmm. by if we're going to go so far as to affirm them in their embracing of a false reality, that cannot possibly lead to their human flourishing and happiness. And in fact, is an indictment of God himself telling God that your plan for male and female biological sex is not good enough, God, right? 